Hey everybody, welcome back to another Dr. Twisted's Toy Time. This weekend we went to Springfield, Missouri. Take my daughter to the Child's Museum and go to a couple thrift stores and Toys R Us was having a free build a Batman Lego deal going on. So we went there. I got a couple pickups to show in the next video, but this is all the thrift store goodies I got while we were there so let me just start off by showing some weird things here the stuff was mostly in bags there was a couple pieces that were loose but pretty much everything else was in bags there's this guy here I don't know if this is like a is this Narnia. I think this is the Narnia kid. Probably a premium. There's a couple of these little plastic animals. I'm not sure what this is, but it's pretty cool. Probably do something with that. It's metal and copper. I'm not sure, but it was in one of the bags couple of these Etch-a-Sketches, this weird little mini plane kite, this uh, Time Flies monster truck, not really sure what this goes to, it's an Avengers controller, this Imaginext dinosaur, now this huge bag, I separated it all out, this is all Cowboys, Indians, and military figures. And there's some. There's a horse drawn wagon. Bunch of little horses. Playset pieces. But I got those bags because there was stuff I wanted in them. This was one of the things that was loose. But I had to get this guy. This guy's awesome. And this awesome Imaginext walker here figure was in it. Looks like it's missing a missile, but that's okay because that is a cool little skull walker. Kind of reminiscent of the old Mo2 spider walker. And in the bags there was this guy. This guy here, I did not notice that his claw was broke off. I did notice this one was broke off, but it's an awesome GoBot. I already have the complete combiner for this thing though, but it's still cool to get again. Got a, one of these, uh, what was it, variant? G.I. Joe Troopers from the newer movies. This vintage turtle here in excellent condition. This guy, I'm not sure what he is. This is like one of the newer Imaginext figures, but I'm not sure what series. This California Raisin. This uh, Buzzsaw Hordak, but it's missing his thing like they all are usually and this other Motu knockoff this Superman car this awesome I think that's a uh, probably trans metals Optimus optimal Optimus this Hulk and this was cool I didn't see that in the bag but that was an awesome little jiggler score bunch of random G.I. Joe bases, some vintage weapons, some newer weapons. So that was cool. This uh, Street Fighter minifigure. And there was a bag of erasers. These were the four highlights in the bag that were within another bag. The two gators are awesome. This corn guy, I always love this one. And this car. And here's the other 
the rest of them that were in the bag. There's a music note. Some other old little animals and things, but nothing too special. There were these, uh, I believe you get these at the dollar store, but they look really cool though. Look like little zombie ninja military dudes. There's this saddle, which is always cool. This uh, Philip stamp. <laughs> this giant. This thing, I think it's one of those electric buzzer dealy doos. This was pretty cool. This, I don't know what the year is, but it's a Coca Cola. It's made in USA by Dunkin' Donuts. This was also in the Cowboys and Indians thing, but I really like this. So I'll be keeping this part, but the rest of them I'm probably going to get rid of. This weird little teddy bear pin. Just a little locket. A couple weird rings. These guys. I think these are the old Imaginext. I'm not exactly sure, but I believe that's what they are. The old body style. This little mini motorcycle. I'm not sure what it goes to. This uh, awesome dog thing here. <laughs> this weird Nintendo membership card. This awesome uh, Elvis Presley driver's license. This was also with the military figures. One of my highlights is I saw this in the bag of those little figures and I'm like wait a minute that's not a Jurassic Park or a Chinosaur or anything that kinda reminds me of Dino Riders and then come to find out it had the figure with the chair I mean it's missing the one side there but it looks like he has his little clip-on weapon it's, uh, some shoulder strap weapons and it also has the ladder and this thing as well. So that was awesome because I got that bag for like $250. And I also got another bag with $250 with all these other guys in it. So this was an awesome haul, if I do say so myself. All kinds of cool goodies. There's a couple other crap items, but nothing special, so I didn't put it up here to waste your time. But there you go, my friends. There was my thrift store haul for this weekend. Some awesome, awesome stuff that I got for the collection. And uh, until next time, my friends, peace.